this uh, opponent took a while to start so I can expect some very special manoeuvres coming along anytime soon so developing the knight spot in the pawn develop the bishop so that we can castle king side let's take the knight off the board before it causes any trouble and castle I feel like I've not seen this position for a while so he's looking at x-raying through to this pawn here so if we pushed here he drops take knight takes knight takes bishop takes so we kind of lose out there don't we bring the rook here first supporting the pawn attacking anyway so we do have the knight that can take this pawn he does still have the two on one but this time it's with the pawn so the knight could take he may bring his queen here to attack our knight so then he's got a three on one on the pawn <laughs> that's probably what's going to happen actually so that he gets the pawn back so queen here we oh he's not doing that Knight coming around to attack the pawn. Don't really like going backwards with my pieces. Maybe we could go here to look to attack his bishop. But then his bishop would just take us. So coming around here attacking the pawn again, then he comes down again, attacks. Whoa, dear me. Let's do that then. And his knight can take this pawn. So he gets the pawn back either way, so roundabout way of doing it okay I expected him to take with the knight but um, our knight was going to be maneuvering so that we would put a pin with the rook onto there okay okay so knight can come back around attacking the bishop still again it's on this pawn So he can take and he's defending the bishop at the same time. Doesn't take that opportunity either. I don't think I'll um, have too many lives left for this pawn. So I might have to defend with this pawn here. Could bring the knight across I suppose defending. Yeah let's do it that way. So a bit of an ugly start. A lot of dancing around. this pawn is blocking my dark square bishop which is a bit of an issue so I really want to be getting the knight here but I suppose it could drop mm hmm let's bring the knight across maybe we can but it probably might push but of strange kind of open it's going for a two on one so we can protect with this pawn three on one protection at the moment and I want to get my bishop into the game but do we need to be attacking this pawn first he's opened up his white square bishop putting more pressure on so he's got one two three but no small piece we've got a small piece so he probably wants to get rid of our small piece so if we went here we could do on pass on we take it back and this 
Bishop's got the deadly diagonal, attacking the pawn. Hmm. He hit the pawn. He doesn't have to take, he hits our pawn. Yeah, he's trying to get rid of the support on this for this pawn. Putting the queen there is a bit dangerous because it's in that diagonal. Bring it there, it's in front of the rook. I need to do something. I need to do something to see if we can block it off. He's probably going to do the on pass on thing. Because he still wants this pawn to get rid of this pawn. Yeah, he does. So he's he charges down I suppose we can push up but then if we push up he does have the free yeah so he's gonna get that pawn I want a better position before yeah he's charging he's charging could take knowing full well the pawn's going could leave it there can anything else replicate no take see the queen takes then the rook has to take really then his knight takes potentially knight takes then the rook takes Ooh, dear 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 that's all heavy stuff just for one pawn which could have been pushed onto the knight <laughs> I'm going to push it onto the night, all that thinking and dancing. And that was surreal. So you can always come back again to attack it again. I suppose we can push it a bit further up not doing that we can still push it further up he's attacking this pawn at the moment that's where bishop defense mode attacking the pawn now attacking the pawn attacking the knight knight jumps down attacks the queen queen takes rook takes Bishop attacks the knight. Oh, that's all a little bit squinchy again. Could just go with a simple basic bishop. Go with a basic bishop defense for now. Oh, free knight. Oh, I can't believe it. Free knight. Oh man, oh man, I've been I'm totally overthinking in this game, absolutely totally overthinking. Wow, it's like I'm scared of something. Oh dear me, <laughs> shocking. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, how do we come back from this then? Okay, let's try and find some good position. Oh, that's so shocking. That's bad form. Oh, he's taking more stuff. No, he's not. Is he taking? Did he take something then? A pawn. Oh, man. I did say that I was expecting some spectacular stuff though, I didn't I? They took a while starting. Let's go here. I did say, I just remembered that. But obviously I hung my own knight there, so it wasn't them doing anything special. Now it's just gobbling everything up. I still assess it even though after you know even if like I did you know I did hang my knight I assess how the opponent then still continues on and how they then take advantage of their advantage and 
looking at the quality of how they take advantage of their advantage you can sense certain anomalies in the way that they suddenly become even better so he's not actually taking the bishop so you'd expect the knight to be taking the bishop really it's coming for like a check of meter just blocking Maybe should have blocked with the knight actually, it's more flexible. Rooks don't have any place in the centre of the board, do they? And plus the rook was defending the, the bishop. Oh my god, shocking game, shocking. I think I'll resign this one. This is um, not good. Queen opposite the king, <laughs> doing something. <laughs> Looking for these cheap, the, I'm going for cheap shots now, I'm going for quick and dirty tactics uh, This is so shocking play, it's unbelievable It's so bad Queen's gone to the other side of the board to attack this pawn. I suppose he's thinking he's easily defended because he just pushes a pawn down, doesn't he? Just pushes that there. But we get a moment of something. Not much, but a little tiny bit of pressure from such a bad situation. We're now trying to go for full on answer process with a check here. Comes down defense. There's not much to do really. Hides in the corner over here. doesn't want to get checked on anymore so he goes into the corner here so then what do we do just going to go here this bishop wants to take the rook here Yeah, which is okay for us. It's going to be two moves away at least. I won't even get that in, or even to here. I'm trying a stealth thing. I'm trying a stealth thing. It's not going to work, but there's two moves away. One there, and he can't go anywhere. But he's got his dark square bishop he's got his rooks he's got his queen that's now deciding oh I think I'm on the wrong side of the board here but I will go and take this pawn to see if I can come back around again one move away one move away wouldn't that be funny if that oh my gosh <laughs> I gotta say I'm putting that down as one of my favorites that was absolutely shocking play but then 
utilizing the answer process of putting pressure on the king area proved a treat absolutely fantastic <laughs>